Hey, what's going on? Recently, a customer, Dan the Man out of Arizona, had a question about the Quick Tool, and I'm glad he asked because there is actually a newer version of the Quick Tool. Uh, this is the older style right here next to it. Now, if you have some of these older styles and you want a new style, the manufacturer has a program. Give them your old one, you'll get a new one. Now, the older Quick Tool, uh, basically, there is a groove on the bottom of the tool and there is a, a slot in the mold on the bottom of the jack to where they're gonna, they're gonna slide the jack on and then terminate it. It's, uh, it's pretty easy, but the new tool has a new design to make it a bit simpler, a bit easier uh, for installations. Basically, you just go ahead and push the jack in there, terminate it, and then that takes care of that. Now, let's go ahead and show you the quick jacks themselves. We have a Cat 3, we have a Cat 5, and a Cat 6. Now, the jacks are all the same style, so that way you only need one tool for uh, each jack. I know some other tools out there, they have you change cutting heads for jacks because they're molded a little differently, but not with this jack. Another nice feature is the jacks have a peak on the top of them that makes it a bit easier to separate all the pairs. Uh, for example, I have this one already wired up with the green, the blue, and the brown pair. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and lace the orange pair down in a sec. But another thing you'll notice about the 560, uh, the Cat 5e jack, the quick jack, it's wired B and A and there's no split pairs. That's another nice feature when you got a ton of these jacks that terminate on a school job or, or a big commercial install. Just makes, makes it a little easier for you out there. Now, as I said with the peaks, it makes it easier to separate the pairs when you install it. So you might want to just come down here, untangle it a little bit, and go ahead and push it in. Just like that, boom, you're done. It'll help separate the conductors, make it a little easier for you. And then with the tool, the new tool, you're going to go ahead and slide it into the front of the jack. And then what this tool does, it terminates and cuts all the pairs at the same time. So you want to go ahead and give it a squeeze and then pull your jack out. Boom, check that out. Clean, terminates it good. Uh, put it on that tester. It's a good jack. This tool's a good labor saver and uh, you can't go wrong with it. It will the only work with the quick jacks. Um, I'm not too sure about getting another jack in there. Whether or not the blades on the tool itself that terminate and cut the pairs will line up with other jacks. Other than that, you can order this online. Questions call us 888-797-3697.